All right, free medical care is available in the tri-state this weekend. Anyone can come out, no questions will be asked, and that includes vision and dental. So uh, as WCPO 9 News reporter Andrew Rowan actually shows us tonight, it's happening because UC students noticed a problem in our area and actually took some action. At St. Xavier High School, I would say start the tents at the edge of sterilization and move to the right. Turning a gym. There's a little dot right here and you just push it in. Into a medical facility. Let's put it there. Is no small feat. We're setting up uh, each of the dental chairs, so the booth's behind me here. Let's go to this one over here. But it's what volunteers spent their Friday doing. You want me to walk all the way around? To get the door open for this clinic. We kind of distance ourselves from the problem, but in reality, these problems are around us everywhere. This weekend, nonprofit Remote Area Medical will offer free dental, vision, and medical care. Local professionals are donating their time. We don't really ask any questions. Anyone can come here. It's open for all. An operation of this scale didn't just pop up. It's really it's surreal to see it all like actually happening in place. UC undergrads spent nearly two years organizing to bring it here after volunteering at nationwide clinics in more remote areas. Uh, even though we're kind of a big city, I think the need is still like uh, here. 14.4 percent of Cincinnati residents are medically uninsured, nearly double the state's figure. It would just really kill me to turn away patients when their copays, uh, something's wrong with their copay, or or we don't cover that insurance. So this is kind of a, a chance for all these patients. Um, yearly just to come here and get everything they need to be uh, they need done. Right now we're in our vision area. We've got our lab truck outside where we're going to make some glasses as well. Volunteers working. We want to see every patient we possibly can. To get everyone a clean bill of health. At the end of the day I think if I just see like a few patients walking out of here like a little bit healthier a little bit happier I think that'll be that'll be pretty successful for me. At St. X, Andrew Rowan, WCPO 9 News. Well, if this is something you could benefit from, the parking lot opens tonight at midnight at St. Nexus High School. It is first come, first serve Saturday and Sunday. You don't need an ID. It is free. It is open to the public.